All right, hello. It's that time again. There's a new Grand Prix, and this one is the Neon Circus. In this video, I'm going to look at the new track, the new characters, new skins, there's a new race mode, there's some kind of like egg hunt to unlock a new character, some kind of chicken, apparently. We're going to see if I can find any of those naughty eggs. So let's begin. So here we go then, Koala Carnival looks like it's going to be picked, that's the new track. I'm very excited to see what it's like. As you can see, I'm playing as Pasadena Opossum, one of the new characters. Also of course there's Koala Kong and Ebenezer Von Clutch to unlock. So here we go then, Koala Carnival, named after Koala Kong. Oh my god, that looks like a huge ramp. This looks very much like a speedway. This is, of course, my first experience of the new track. I've not seen anything online. I've not raced it or practiced it myself. So I'm going to be a bit pants. We'll see how this goes. I've not even played CTR that much recently. Woohoo! That's a big jump to start. Off we go! Oh, I didn't even get a power up then. Right, I presume they... Yeah, I was going to say, I presume they're going to blow some fire up my ass, And they did straight away. Oh, right, there's a split path there. Whoopsie-daisy, I'm in last. No idea if anyone else has already done this track that I'm racing against. It's all random people online. I don't know. I guess the big ramp was quicker. <laughs> I will go for the middle ramp next lap. Right, there's ramps everywhere. It was gonna, it's going to take a lot to practice once I know how to do it. I will be much better at it. All those musical notes. I've been blown up by something. I've been last. Are those deadly, those notes? Or I guess avoid them. Oh, that's pretty neat. Triple bounce. All right, that's one lap. So, a pretty short track there. I think that's around about maybe a 30 second lap without all those terrible mistakes. Get it bonked by my mask. Also, Pasadena, therefore, does use the Aku Aku mask. There's no new mask for her. Okay, the middle one was a blue flame boost. So, yeah, I really should have gone for the middle one. Oh, I'm making up positions now. I'm keeping this blue flame very well. Right, let's keep it over these ramps up into third position. This is a very fun track. I'm really enjoying this one. Very easy to learn as well. There's not too much complications. That's a bit hard to get through, but haha, -ha, I'll hit you with a rocket. I'm not sure about catching leader. It depends if they keep the blue flame through the Olympic rings. Da, 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 la, 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 da, da, da. Yeah. Right, come on. If I kept this blue flame, it's looking good, but I think the leader's kept it. There are some speed boosts through here, but you've got to watch out for those musical notes. That's going to be tough. Looks like I'm going to have to settle for second, but I will take that. My first online race of the new track, second position. I am very impressed with this track. This one could become one of my new favourites. It's very short, look at those times there, 34 seconds and 36 seconds on my second and third lap. So my only downside of this track is it's a bit short, but that was very fun. Okay, so it's now time to look at some of the new skins that are available this month. Cortex has a new skin, it's Clown Cortex. Oh dear me, look away if you're scared of clowns. Ooh, arr, we got Farmer in Jim with a carrot in his head. That's a pretty cool design. I love how they did that with the carrot rather than the rocket. <laughs> that, that's a really fun skin. I really want that skin. That's going to be one of my new favourites. Oh, look at him. Penta Jester. Penta Penguin has a new skin this month as well. Oh, dearie me. The class clown. Faint Crash has yet another new skin. He's getting quite a few these days. We've got Rustic Fake Crash. I think this one was leaked as Hillbilly Fake Crash, but it's come up as Rustic Fake Crash. Maybe Hillbilly's offensive. I'm not sure. Is Hillbilly offensive? It might be. Sorry if you're offended by that. And as you can see, Nash now has a legendary skin. Not too many characters are without a legendary skin now. Cannibal Nash with his Murica helmet. Looks like all the Nitro Squad now have new legendary skins. They've all got circus versions. We've got Circus Amy there with a little hat. We've also got new Megumi, Circus Megumi. That's nice. That all look a bit bland. Nothing special. Oh my. I was going to say it all look a bit bland, but then Liz has gone mad. She's having another one of her phases, dearie me. 
Deary me, I thought it was only gonna be Liz, but looks like Isabella has very short hair with her new circus outfit. Deary me, looking very punk there. And of course we've got the three new characters. Two of them were from Crash Tag Team Racing, a game I didn't play too much. We've got Pasadena Opossum, that's her standard. We've also got Licorice, do people like Licorice? She doesn't have a legendary, we've got Daredevil Pasadena. That's pretty much the same as Nash. You could just wear Nash's outfit, Pasadena. Silly. And of course, we've got Ebenezer Von Clutch, also from Tag Team Racing. I still, I don't know too much about it. It's been years since I've played the game and I didn't play it that much. Was he a bad guy in that game? I think he was the bad guy. We've got Stuntman Van Clutch. Looks like we've got Nash as a cannibal, we've got a Pasadena, and we've now got Van Clutch. They've all got the same outfit. That's a bit lazy. I don't mind it though. And we've got the big beefy man himself, Koala Kong. He looks bigger than Tiny. I'm not sure if he was always bigger than Tiny, but dearie me, look at those beefy muscles. I'm more even going to see past him. That's all you're going to... If you're behind Koala Kong, that's all you're going to see. <laughs> He's huge. Something else that's new for this Grand Prix is a new race mode, Ring Rally. So it looks like this is available on every circuit. So far as I can tell, yep, yeah, looks like all of them. We'll do the boring thing and do Crash Cove. Mirror mode off, I don't want mirror mode. That'll make it even more... Can you do mirror mode ring rally? That's already insane. Right, let's change character. I don't want to be Crash, that's boring. Look at those rainbow wheels. Oh, they look cool. Right, here we go then. We're ready for ring rally. No idea what this entails. We will see. Right, here we go then, Crash Cove Ring Rally. So I'm guessing you go through the rings. That is what makes sense, right? Do you gain time from going through the rings? Is it how many rings you go through? I'm not sure, almost forgot to change camera. That's put me off the start, dearie me. Okay, you get speed boost every time you go through a ring. Way up through the shortcut. That helps with the shortcut as well, those rings. Okay, so it looks like you get scores from going through the rings. Go down there. Oh, looks like some rings over here. Also, sorry if you can hear my controller. It's vibrating all over the place. Right, we've got gold rings now. Oh, I've got blue flame. Holy crap, this is, this is pretty fun. This is a fun new game mode. I'm enjoying this. Much more fun than time trial. Plus the fact that you can get blue flame. Right, how many rings have I got? 68 rings. I can imagine the records are going to be something mad like... Oh, someone managed to get 10,000 rings. That is very vibrating. <laughs> I hope that's not too annoying. Right, through the purple rings. Oh, I almost lost my boost there. Came very close to hitting that rock. We're still going then. I'm still getting more time. I'm, I've got more time than what I had on the second lap. Is it still getting faster? I'm not sure. We could be here all day. But... Oh, the rings are getting smaller. I've just noticed the rings are getting smaller. Those are some small rings. It's like threading a needle at the moment. Oh, no, I've missed my first ring, I think. Unless I missed one earlier. I'm not 100% sure. All right, there we go. I'm not kind of sure what score I want to get. Just keep going until I fail, really. Oh, dearie me, that very small. I've never seen a ring that small in my life. Whee! I'm still going though, we're still getting the shortcut. As soon as I fail the shortcut, I am screwed. Oh, I can't, oh, these are very small now. <laughs> I keep getting surprised at how small the rings keep going. Does it go on forever? Do the rings keep getting small until it's literally like a millimetre wide? <laughs> we, we might find out. I'm not sure if I'm close to failing or not. Oh wait, no, my time is going down. I'm missing rings now because they're so small. I'm jumping over them. We're running low. <laughs> this is a very small ring. It's like almost as small as a party ring. Oh dear, oh no. Party rings, by the way, are a British biscuit. I oh, know I'm about to run out of time. No, that's the last one. There we go. Eight laps, new high score. 261,989. See if you can beat that one. That was my first attempt. Really enjoyed that mode. That was really fun to play. Right, there is one more thing. Apparently there are now golden eggs hidden in all the hub worlds in the adventure mode. I'm not sure how... Oh, I was about to say I'm not sure how big they are. 
or where they are, but there's, there's one right there. How how do you get it? <laughs> it's in the middle of the sky. What? How to? Huh? How to? Like, I'm too small. Do I have to be a bigger character made from a bigger character? <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> I'm too small. What? Is there a jump somewhere? Oh, wait a minute. Did you manage to somehow jump from down here? I get a lot of speed boost and then jump up like that. Let's have a look. Let's try and do a whole lap and we'll see if we can jump up and get it. I was kind of thinking, oh, they might be really well hidden and you might not be able to find them for ages because they'll be so small. But no, the exact opposite. They're massive, but they're hard to collect. Right. We've got some speed. Oh, oh dearie me, no. That, oh, no, I've missed it. I've messed up. I could be here all day. I might not get this egg. Oh, dearie me. Well, at least you know where the first egg is. I've given you a bit of a clue. Oh, I got it. Hey, that's one egg. So there's four more to find. I won't try and spool all the rest of them. That's up for you to work out how to get the other ones. But you do unlock a naughty chicken character, which I'm very excited about. Okay then, so there is one more character to show off. I got all the eggs and I unlocked King Chicken! You can now play it as a chicken! Does he have any more skins? Oh, he actually does! Okay, we've got a King Turkey. <laughs> we've got a King Phoenix. I've got King Stunt Chicken. <laughs> Look at him, he's a... <laughs> he's a chicken! Chicken Team Racing confirmed. But yes, that's the Neon Circus first look, first impressions. I'm very much looking forward to this Grand Prix until inevitably two weeks in, I stop buying and then I get excited about the next one, which will be the Christmas Grand Prix, which again, I will do a video on. Thank you everybody for watching and don't forget to unlock the King Chicken. Take care and leave me alone.